We're, we're at the Arc Total Wealth uh, Monthly um, Barbie, and we are privileged to have Rob Judd, who's a fantastic supporter of Arc. Welcome to Arc, Rob. Thank you, Ivan. Rob, tell us a bit about what you do. Ah, well, I help companies get benefits from the government for carrying out product development. So it's termed research and development in the legislation, but a lot of companies qualify for this benefit. So you work for BSI R&D, BSI... BSI Innovations. Innovations, yes, great. Yeah, yeah. Okay, great. So tell us this R&D tax concession, tell us a bit about what these uh, innovative companies can get. Basically, any company that's developing a product, investing its own money at its own risk, can claim on the Research and Development Tax Concession Scheme. This comes in two forms. If you're a company that's in profit, you can claim a benefit as a tax saving, which is very useful to most companies. Alternatively, if, if your company has accumulated losses, you can trade those losses for a R&D tax benefit or cash payment. So the scheme works for both large companies in profit and small companies who are in rapid growth mode. So, so let me get this right. I've got a company with a million dollars worth of tax losses. Okay? Yep. I've, the reason why I've got these tax losses is because I've spent it on developing this U-Beaut software package. That's right. Pure R&D. Submit a claim for a million dollars and the government will give me how much back in cash? If you submit a claim for a million dollars, your benefit will be 250000 That's the 25% on top of that million, but you'll get 30% back on the 1250000 So 30% of that is um, about 40000 roughly. So, the, so if I spend a million dollars, I'm going to get, what, 400000 or 375000 375000 that's right. 375 grand back in cash. That's right. But I lose my tax loss. You lose your tax loss because... But who cares? That's right. I cash mean, is I, cash. It, you either wait till you start, you, you start entering uh, profit stage to claim it as a tax deduction... Or you can take it early as a cash payment, and most of my clients, obviously, uh, uh, would prefer the cash flow. Uh, over the years, these innovative companies have been cash staffed, so they can actually get cash back from the government through the R&D tax. That's right. It's a great it's, scheme. It's called the R&D tax rebate, isn't it? That's right. Yeah. It's uh, a great scheme because it's giving money to high-growth companies that are developing useful products when they need it. Tell us a success story. A success story. Um, that would be, I'm just trying to think um, of one that's, I can't mention names here. No, it's okay. Tell us about the product. Well, there's a, there's a uh, software product that is in the music business that uh, is uh, retailing music to uh, an, over the internet to a whole variety of clients. It's been able to develop its product with the, with the benefit of an R&D tax offset payment for the last five years. Wow. And they've, without that tax rebate, they would have, it would have taken them a lot longer. They may not have even, even Correct. been able to commercialise it. Correct. And they wouldn't have been able to employ as many people, which well, is the point of the scheme. From Rob, the well, keep up that good work. Get innovation happening. And let's have fun together. Thank you, Ivan. Cheers, Rob. All right.